welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome how is your day going your night going your week going i hope everything is awesome so now i'm here with one of my favorite japanese urban legends i mean i love them all they're all my faves i know i always say that but this one um i remember that's actually one of my first paranormal videos i posted on here it's not here anymore course because as you know i deleted my old videos don't ask me why because i don't even know that sucks but here i am to refilm it so this urban legend is called mary san or mary chan chan mary chan i do not know how to pronounce these things i do not know how to pronounce anything so forgive me i know i've had people on my i don't remember which video i think it was um the one called kagome kagome I don't know, but I got comments like, what does she say? Kagami, Kagami like that and all that stuff. And I'm like, I don't know what this, I suck at pronouncing things. The important thing is that you know what I'm saying, right? I love the Japanese language. I, well, I haven't been studying lately, but I'm gonna get back to it. I used to study every day cause I really like, that's one of my dreams to learn Japanese and go to Japan once and be like, be there for at least a month. Before we get started though, I just want to say that if you're new here, hello, post new videos every week, every Tuesday and Friday. Sometimes um, if I really have like something going on, I might post it some other day, but I'll always let you guys know. So yeah, if you enjoy spooky things, this is a place for you. I would love it if you go ahead and subscribe and become part of this little spooky bell fam. And if you want to hear all about this scary Japanese urban legend, just go ahead, turn off your lights and stick around. So there are different versions for this particular urban legend. A lot of versions, actually. There's even a movie inspired by it. That movie totally freaks me out, by the way. I think it's called One Less Call. I think so. I don't remember, but I'm gonna just like put it right here. Watch that movie. I just cannot deal with the idea of hearing myself dying. Like before I die, like yikes, that's so freaky. There's actually two movies. There's um the Japanese version. And the western version, of course, both of them very freaky, so yeah, check it out. So there's this doll named Mary-san, or Mary-chan, like I said, I don't know how to pronounce it. And it was a very popular doll in Japan, like back in the day, of course. I think it still might be, I'm not sure. It was just like Barbie, let's put it that way, but the Japanese version of it. So once upon a time, this doll belonged to this little girl who absolutely loved her. They were like best friends, but as time passed, the girl played less and less with her she was growing up of course and then it came to a point where she didn't play with her at all she completely forgot all about her so it was time for her to move out of her parents house she got her own place she was like grown up already and she left all of her old like toys everything at her house her childhood home including Mary son. So some time passed, new people moved into the house, her childhood home, where all her old stuff was at. So these people threw everything out, of course. They didn't want no junk in their new house from people they don't even know. So one night she was at her new place and the phone rang. She picks up and on the other side, a voice says, Hello, I'm Mary. I'm in a trash can right now. The girl freaks out and hangs up. She keeps getting phone calls from the same number and each time the thing, the person or whatever is telling her they're closer and closer to where she is. Like, hi, I'm Mary, I'm right down the street. And it goes on and on. And then she says, hi, I'm Mary, I'm outside. And the girl goes outside, like she opens the door and she looks and there's nobody there. And she's like, oh shit. <laughs> you know, so she goes back inside and then she doesn't get a call for a while and then she gets one last call that says hi I'm Mary I'm right behind you so she turns around and guess what some versions will say that it was a doll some versions will say that it was just like um, a pale girl that looked like the doll maybe it was like a spirit that was possessing the doll I'm not sure but yeah there are a lot of versions to this and what happened to the girl nobody really knows but to this very day people in Japan they're like terrified of this doll and I bet they're pretty scared of getting like phone calls from unknown numbers as well like I hardly pick up if i don't know who's calling me i'm not i'm not gonna pick up so yeah the movie goes like this um it's a little different i'm gonna talk about the one 
in um, I think it's from the United States. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna talk about that one or maybe Canada. I'm not sure. It's just um, the English version of it. So the movie's a little different. It talks about this like, it's kind of like a virus or whatever. I really don't remember. I watched it like years ago. I'm just gonna like um, tell you a little bit about the movie so you wanna watch it. I don't know. But um, let's say I had your number and I get this call. I'm cursed. And then after I die, everyone, I don't know if it's everyone on my phone, like on my contacts, they're gonna get the same call and they're gonna die too within days. I don't know if it's within days. I don't remember, like I said. But it's really freaky because um, you get this phone call and then you hear yourself dying. And it's just like really creepy in my opinion. That's not my ringtone. It's you, dying. Ever since that bizarre phone call, I keep seeing things. So yeah, that movie freaked me out. I don't remember the Japanese version. I don't think it's like that. I think it's like more like the urban legend, but they all talk about this um, mysterious phone call and uh, yeah. I know this one I just told you has nothing to do with the urban legend. I'm just saying that that's where they got like the inspiration from. It's all about this mysterious phone call that will supposedly kill you. Yep. So yeah, what do you guys think of this urban legend? Have you ever heard of this before? What would you do if you got that call? I would just like, I don't even know. Let me know what you think of this legend. Have you ever heard of this before? And have you ever seen any of the movies I just mentioned? Wow, I am really caffeinated right now. Like that thing I was drinking, it's like, it's not coffee. Is what is that? Triple shot energy. Like nothing will ever get me this caffeinated unless I drink like three or four cups of coffee. Wow, I was like, this thing's not gonna wake me up, but damn. I don't even know what I'm telling you this. Uh, anyway, thank you so much for taking time today to just watch this video. It means a lot to me. I hope you're having an awesome day or night. And I'll see you till my next video. Toodles.